My name is Michael Rubenfeld, a.k.a. the Lucky Jew of Poland. When I first arrived in Poland, I discovered that some people buy and sell images of Jews from the olden days holding and counting money. I learned that when you put them on the wall, they are supposed to bring you luck with money. At first, I thought these pictures were problematic. The image of the Jew and money is a harmful stereotype that has perpetuated anti-Semitism throughout history. But then I realized that actually, I might be looking at this the wrong way, and that this is an incredible opportunity for the Jews. I thought that Jews were only unlucky in Poland, but perhaps this was a sign that it's time for the Jews to prosper again in Poland. Maybe I'm luckier than I thought. And so, I started a business selling pictures of myself for luck. I put my picture on anything I could find, and I sold them during the famous Emmaus Easter market in Krakow. And I was an overnight sensation. People bought all my products, and my videos became a viral sensation. People were writing articles about me all over the world. Finally, the Jew is once again welcome in Poland. Well, I was wrong. An organization called Festivalt, run by some do-gooder Jews, decided that the Jew with the coin had to go. And they used my business to get the attention of the city of Krakow to help them understand why the image of the Jew with the coin is a problem. Festivalt then organized a series of roundtable events with the city and experts from around Poland to discuss the problem of the lucky Jew. This resulted in the city making a public statement saying the Jew with the coin is in fact an anti-Semitic image. And then the final nail in the coffin, the city took over the regulations of the Amos Easter Market and now will no longer permit the Jew with the coin to be sold there. They have put me out of business. How could Jews do this to other Jews? Me, a hardworking Jew in Poland, and once again, the Jews are being persecuted in Poland on Easter. Well, I have a message to Festivalt and the city of Krakow. This lucky Jew might be down, but he's not out. Mark my words, you may have won this battle, but you will not win the war against Jewish luck. <laughs>